Major Namkin, Tadan Yami, Sumjin, Tamjiji, Tong, Lana Mepa, Yanda, Zogi, Sondiji, Combat Rumboch, Jenny, Tobaraja Yambat. Teacher, the Tambi, Chundin, Sente, Trigan, to Yamsu, Lan Yambi, Golon, Kuchuji, Rumban, Nekwar Sartati, Sembar, it is important to set up one's motivation by thinking that one must achieve the perfect, complete Buddhahood for the benefit of all mother sentient beings, um, whose number is infinite, um, infinite, infinite like space. For that purpose, one should uh, listen to this teaching carefully and put it into practice. <laughs> So the topic you're going to listen to today is uh, is about emptiness, the correct view of emptiness. Yes. <coughs> So, um, there's a particular sutra uh, which is requested by this uh, Bodhisattva Yungurkyung. And in, this, in that sutra, it says that um, the beings, sentient beings, by not knowing the, the reality of phenomena, uh, emptiness, uh, emptiness, or um, uh, shiva's um, pacifications, emptiness, pacifications, and uh, things are not uh, rise independently. So not rising independently, or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, by not knowing these uh, beings, are wandering in a cyclic existence. <coughs> So all the com uh, compounded phenomena has uh, three characteristics, three aspects. The first one is the cause, and then second, the result, effect, and then third one is the, the nature. So all these phenomena are empty of inherent existence is named as a, as a, the doors of three characteristics. What did you think I just said with that? Tarwa Tobar and Dobar Namjis. Anne, ah, did that Tony and Comarchego yourself? Because those who are um, desire to attain liberation uh, must realize this and meditate upon this. What did Tony Comarchiva Yenas? Then the Tarwa Tom Nuva Tongs. Tell you, Yemba Shikta, Anne. So, by meditating upon these, um, one is um, uh, able to attain liberation. Otherwise, uh, it is impossible to attain liberation. That is because of the, uh, the the very root of cyclic existence, uh, that the cyclic existence, the nature of suffering, um, cyclic existence is the um, uh, uh, ignorance grasping the self. So, without abandoning the ignorance grasping itself, without get rid of ignorance grasping itself, it is impossible to attain liberation. 
if one can manage to get rid of these ignorance grasping itself, then um, one is guaranteed to attain liberation. So it is important, um, initially, it is important to identify what is the root of undesirable things in cyclic existence. So some might uh, mistakenly identify um, that um, the root of cyclic existence is is created by by God. So in order to um, uh, attain liberation, they uh, try to please, you know, try to please uh, gods by uh, uh, making um, offerings of um, animal sacrifice offerings. So that is because of not knowing the very root of cyclic existence or not be able to identify the root of cyclic existence, suffering. So when is one uh, when one uh, is not be able to identify the root of sac uh, suffering, cyclic existence, then uh, one will mislead by these uh, wrong paths, you know, which harms oneself as well as others. <coughs> Um, <coughs> so some of the non-Buddhist schools, for such as Jain um, tradition, um, uh, identify identifies as the root of cyclic existence. Um, identify um, the karma as the root of sac uh, suffering, cyclic existence. What is that? That new moon from the table and the sun back. So what? Lead sevichu to the kali yakyo imbari. So those uh, practitioners do not pursue in order to uh, get rid of um, afflictions. They try to exhaust or finish their karma and then put a lot of effort for that. So, according to Jains, they say if you um, purify the negativities that you have accumulated in the past and try not to engage or accumulate any new karma or, uh, or clash, um, karma actions, negative actions, then you will attain liberation. So so, um, for according to um, this school, uh, Jane, in order to get rid of, uh, in order to purify negativities, they engage in um, in a, uh, ascetic practices, f such as uh, um, such as not wearing clothes, you know, being naked, you know, experience suffering of cold and 
di sadang dungin yang sawa nak tangi dungin heat and cold and uh, in order to you know in order to purify negativities uh tene karsagi an ta na yida saya nan tong ya to so jin yan to ka na ti ga yun ni ba da and also not you know, eat, do not eat do not yeah try not to eat and drink and experience you know the hunger and thirst da da yik ani ji ah and some um, stand on one leg for a long period of time in order to purify their negativities. And they <coughs> um, 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 burn, you know, the part of their body, limbs. Uh, as well as jump on a on a, a spear 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 yes spear. What in it? Kali na so si jaku yo imbaris rejita kali jabat dan jibu ani lise na tharwa thobya the me imbaris jawa. So although they mm, they um, put a lot of effort to get rid of the karma these kar- karmas but but this is impossible through this it it is impossible to attain liberation so um, by um, get rid of the karmas and even even if you can manage to get rid of karmas that you have accumulated in the past <coughs> but if you don't abandon don't don't um, uh, uproot the, the afflictions then um, you will accumulate new Karmas by afflictions. The nyomu wa siyata be ane sebar pang wa yin as. Tane nga sakyak bi li yo ba yin na yin. Ko ane. Ta lenji nyomu mi ya ba yin sa. Di ke tane. Korbat ye ba le menu ba yin ba yin ba yin ba So by abandoning uh, or uh, get rid of afflictions. Uh, even if you have ka- negative karmas that you have accumulated past. Uh, because of not, uh, uh, you and you won't won't take a rebirth in a sacred existence, under the power of of afflictions. So as a root of afflictions, uh, um, 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 as the uh, the ignorance. Ignorance grasping the self. What you need to do? How to do you good? Dens and the river, and it comes all more than Garmi, Chicken, the new attachment, said you that Chambat and India last water, and it did not go back in your chamboretis. On a dens and marigua dance, and the tongue was in cargo yomers. No, so the need to do that, the mood in your mundo by him. No, so as it stated in a, in a text, uh, says that love and so forth. Since love and so forth are not directly contradict to um, to uh, uh, ignorance grasping the self, um, they cannot be the antidote. Or by by these by these you cannot abandon uh, um, the the root of sacred existence. But in general, of course, um, meditating on uh, cultivating love and so forth are uh, tremendously beneficial. But but these uh, 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 do not contradict directly to the um, to ignorance grasping itself. So as a direct antidote uh, to ignorance grasping itself is, as I mentioned earlier, 
the uh, wisdom realizing emptiness or meditating on cultivating uh, wisdom realizing emptiness. What can this one yin sas? Tadak tu ye nga bi tap tur tan ka riwa yada kun yin zu ban ji se di da. Ane tadak te ne den zi ji ye ma tu jin da. Ane koran chan bi sim ji ta da. La ane bi tu wasan ji jom din di ji da. อ่าเจ้าหญิงยิ่งบุบุตินี่เซ็งนี่ครับว่าอันนี้ทักยิ่งอ่าตักโกเรศนามันดูอันนี้นำรังธรรมะเต็งอันนี้ท่านนายเอ
on dopan chiwa se ta dekhwa pungi thap den ba ba de so this are the the means <coughs> to get rid of negativities ta tene phar do dab no dokwa de se ta no phar do kar so wa re se de ta dakran ki chitu ba ka khane se ani dak me ji ta ba den ba re so hi ba re ro and in the middle uh, he uh, taught um the self selflessness so the um the rash uh, jitwakane refuting the self um self um existence self and then uh, taught the self selflessness that only get how say that that been consultable to go in but the rash jitwakane so the self here is referring to uh to persons that persons are uh, referring <coughs> persons uh, the, uh inherent existent persons and tama taiki kun do wa se ju da tama te ne pongo da so fi chu to so ne yong zo pa de ba ta ba ka kan ni ke te ne ane kong de ju ba ji ba ri so at the end um a uh, refuted um um existence inherent existence of aggregates and so forth all other phenomena what can be hidden ki wa is that that you choose that Surely, what he was in, and the data we get, he get, and he was he be transcend all these things. So those who know um, these um, realities uh, as regarded as 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 scholars. Oh, then this again, Jota. I know. Don't worry. We have the good news to learn about us. I know. Ah, going to some that I know. Jabson Rova Tongs, any Lindy Langdor Langley Cariate, and he sat here with Tongs. No, so neither. When you see other that, talk with Tablan Bego, you insert. So, as a basis, uh, okay, in order to cultivate emptiness, one should have the basis for, uh, one should, has a, uh, should have a base which is, um, which is going for refuge in three jewels and uh, abide by law of causality. Because the um the some um um may um um how do you call that uh proclaim that you know understanding uh um but by realizing emptiness, you know, uh, proclaim how to say that. Um, um, don't when you talk by him, see that. Oh, he did long to learn, 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 So there's, uh, some says that, uh, and, uh, to merely understanding emptiness is sufficient when, uh, 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 it's not necessary to engage in, uh, cultivating, um, Virtuous actions and abandon or uh, get rid of the negative actions, mm. purify negative <coughs> actions. <coughs> so they are actually the interpreting the, uh, the um, Buddha's teaching, uh, those teachings about. Um, uh, uh, refuge teachings about uh, law of causality. Um, uh, generosity, morality. So, uh, okay, um, those teachings about you know accumulating virtuous actions, virtuous <coughs> karma, and then uh, purify negativities are ma taught mainly for those who haven't realized emptiness. And they say if you realize emptiness, um, you do not engage in these actions. So they say, uh, <coughs> they, they say the, those who real, have realized emptiness and then <coughs> engage in these practices uh, will be like, uh, like a king 
you know, a king who is working as as a regular uh, people. What is that? Okay, the only what is that? What is that? Don't have hebo yundi cheso things. Don't need that. What is that? Hebo zindo ne. Kiang yela mejeva. That have to far lom ne ne yundi chese kuyori zongi barita. So those beings actually, um, 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 how do you say that? Um, um, uh, by pretending, uh, pretending, realizing emptiness, pretending, by pretending, realize emptiness, they will uh, ignore all the law of causality and so forth. Mm-hmm. So they still they think that this is the the the, the supreme practice, the supreme uh, how do you call that? Uh, um, the cars again. You need to hear the same. Oh, that. I need to admit you didn't have to win. You know, that the kind of yellow my my dear Virginia, you know, going out of that. So, um, uh, actually, um, not thinking about anything is the best uh, practice. They think. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> So those um, um, they will um, miss the opportunity to uh, 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 accumulate merit and wisdom. So accumulate accumulation of of merit and wisdom. Okay. So, um, the uh, accumulating merit, accumulating merit and wisdom is the essence, essential practice, uh, uh, essential, so, uh, um, okay, it says the, the Gunjin Longchen, Longchen Ramjamba says that, uh, uh, the, the the practice of of unification of uh, merit and wisdom is uh, is the best practice, and this is my ningtam um, uh, uh, is like uh, the word from my heart, something like that. What did this do? That so the point is that um, even though one uh, try to uh, meditate on emptiness, one should um, um, regard or one should take as the basis of one's practice uh, karma. Okay, the the uh, law of causality should be one's. Uh, main practice, the the basis of one's practice. Oh, the young that Thomas, I mean, car is good, da. Ah, don't buy any gums, sir. Send a man to. I mean, long time could damn like thinking, da. Ah, even he was a zari, I think he just boy zari. Initially, it is important to find a uh, a teacher who can guide you, um, or who can show you. The unmistaken uh, instructions, unmistaken instructions uh, on, <coughs> excuse me, on special insight or wisdom realizing emptiness. Oh, tell me, is it that? Don't worry, you know what? Can't just sing your own language. I need your boss. I need your input. And then um, the second <coughs> step is listen carefully. You know, listen these instructions very carefully. Oh, yeah, but some the Maya water water, only tea don't so so good be. 
And then not just um, listening, but then uh, one should contemplate uh, by reasoning. One should contemplate um, uh, and try to cultivate the wisdom of contemplation. So that must be conjoined with uh, extensive accumulation of merit. As, as it is stated in um, Shantideva's Guide to the Bodhisattva's Way of Life, um, all these branches are taught means to, for, for, uh, for means of cultivating the wisdom, um, uh, uh, in order to cultivate wisdom, right? All these branches are referring to um, six practices of, uh, uh, okay, the generosity and so forth. You know, the, the generosity and so forth are taught in order to uh, cultivate wisdom. And uh, also, it is necessary to. Uh, to um, to make you know a strong prayer of supplications to one's uh, guru deity. And so these conditions, the inner and outer conditions, must be uh, come together in order to uh, 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 come together, and then one should engage in. Uh, 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 the practices of cultivation, how to call that? Uh, one should cultivate the wisdom realizing emptiness. So, um, emptiness or s and selflessness are a synonyms. So then, what is emptiness and what is selflessness? Then it is it is stated in a um, four hundred stanza. Since all this phenomena has no uh, um, um, they are not exist you know independently all phenomena since no since all phenomena are uh, wrong about this. Exist independent. independent, right? Um, has no independence. Okay, all phenomena uh, have no independence. Because of that, uh, there are selflessness. And when uh, the, the glorious Chandakirti wrote uh, a commentary for this uh, uh, 400 stanza. Um, then the, the meaning of selfless, selflessness is... Okay, the self is... Uh, um, is, is, uh, self means... Uh, um, is, uh, <coughs> is which is not uh, dependent upon 
anything else. Self means not depending upon anything else. Oh, this. What the me falla to the dark me situation? So non-existence of that, or the uh, uh, empty of in, uh, existence of that, is selflessness. Oh, then is going to that. Then then I also that any. So, um, the, um, uh, the varieties of things, uh, external, inner, and outer phenomena, uh, do appear to us. So, when these appear to us, it appear to us as if they are not uh, depending upon our minds. It's what? not from the mind, but it appears to us as if they are exist from their own side. What is it? That you uncle say, and it tell us, you don't want a movie and a chair partner was zonk your water, no doubt. So then we superimpose on phenomena um, some uh, kind of appealing or attractive, attractive, sorry, and some are not. What do you want to do? You don't want to do that. You want to do that. So by a, a superimposition of Things, uh, things being attractive, we generate, um, yeah, well, generate um, uh, attachment. What? That you do more what do that we want? Ani mendo ba jab ji chok ni nam ba chira wata kang ta ani she dang ji yu imbar. So by um, seeing or viewing things are are not attractive, we generate aversion. Or hatred. What you doing? Also, I think the the So then, you know, these uh, the the words that we we use that I love that, no, I don't like it. I like that. I don't like it. You what know. What he want to say that? I'm lazy. Are you So because of that, then we accumulate karma. Okay. What lazy want to say that? So then the by the by the power of by the karma um Le um uh, through this karma or the, by this karma then we um we uh, um uh, take a rebirth in a cyclic existence and experience suffering. So, um, so without depending upon our minds, you know, things appear as if they exist from their own side. On this, on the so now what so things are actually not exist as they appear to us. So then, if that's the case, if things appears to, uh, appear to us as they as they exist from their own side, then why, uh, then what is the the kariwangi that you carry the yours? What kind of causes, you know, uh, uh, for that? Oh, say you that. What the kind of causes that make that makes that make you know things appear things appear to us like in this way? So 
So, um, so we have this cause of error, cause of errors. It's called a cause of error, uh, which is the ignorance grasping self. That uh, uh, overpowers, overpowers our mind. Does it make sense? Because of that, things appear to us as they exist from their own side. So when you actually grasp, grasp, you know, in that way, as they appear to you, then you are viewing things are uh, uh, truly existent. So that is the. Uh, Shen la rak maleba. Shen means others. Rak maleba means not dependent on others. Uh, oh. It's naturally. It's a natural. It's kind of ngui um, rang uh, It's like that. What? What you can listen now that young time now. So you will not know to tell you that you may be able to. Ah, can this again? You can listen now that young time. So whatever things appear to us, to us, to uh, ordinary beings, um, they appear as they exist, as if they exist from their own side. Mm -hmm. There's no other ways to appear uh, things to you know ordinary beings. Mm -hmm. But in reality, things do not exist as they appear to us. So therefore, thing uh, selflessness. The examples are in uh, the elephants, horses, and horses and houses and so forth in your dream. If things are not exist as they appear to us, um, and if things are not exist as they appear to us, um, then how do we know that things are not exist in that way? So if things exist from their own side, then upon investigation, uh, when you analyze, investigate uh, those things, whether they exist from their own side or not, then if they exist from their own side, then you should be able to f able to find, you know, uh, find something. You know, you should be able to f able to find, um, or it should be, uh, it should become more clear upon investigations. <laughs> For such, for for example, if if you're seeing something from distance, you know you cannot identify what is you know what is it. But as you you know getting closer to that you know uh, that thing that you're seeing from long distance. That thing will become more clear and clear, right, as you approach to, to that, that object. So likewise, if um, if the inner and outer phenomena, uh, or phenomena, if they're uh, not merely uh, labeled by names and you know conceptual thoughts, labeled by names and ter terms, if they exist from their own side, then 
uh, upon investigation, you should be you should be able to find uh, something. Um, uh, you should be you should be able to find something. When we say I and you, you know, when we say I, it appears to our mind, you know, something solid, something that we can touch or we can, um, something that's kind of tangible, right? right? So then, the the when you um, it's not just you know uh, this okay um, you are not just happy with the the term the name I if you try to further investigate further analyze what is I where is I you know how how it is. Um So you cannot really find that I so upon investigation if um uh if the i exist from its own side or i exist uh inherently then you should be able to find that i either upon your aggregates or upon something else. So, um, so we have five aggregates, right? Uh, we are we all are familiar with five aggregates or not, but we are definitely familiar with you know our body and mind. We right we have we do think that we have a body and <coughs> we know we have a body and mind. So we should be able to find this I either with body or with mind. So when you analyze this way, the body body is not the I. Because we do say my body, right? My body. So we um, do think that I is something, someone who possess this body, right? If the body is I, if were, the body were I, the I, <coughs> then you have to divide your body into five, uh, the uh, two um, arms and two legs, and plus your head. It makes five. <laughs> So we have to find. Uh, do we ha do we have uh, eyes upon all these five limbs? Then we have uh, have to have five eyes. Although we have uh, you know five limbs, body, but eye is 
it seems like one, right? Jadi ini kanda ini lute naik sembari lewa. So so body probably not the eye. Say, di macam tu di ini lute tahun lagi orang lewa. So when when we die, we uh we abandon this body. We uh, we uh, we uh leave behind, you know, this body. Uh, so our eye should take a new body. So that the conventional eye, the mere eye, should uh, will take a new body. Take a pawn or take or would t huh? So the, then we, most of us, you know, uh, we have the, the, the bigger doubt, you know, bigger topachishu is like, uh, we, we, uh, okay, we, uh, uh, mostly, okay, we think that mind, probably the eye. Great, mm -hmm. But when the the thought of I arise, um, it seems like um, okay, so that. Thought of when the thought of I arise, um, so that that the thought, you know, there's a thought, and then there's I as the object of that thought. So that object I seems like not the mind. The concept you understand. Ah, under some long time, like me, same secure was. Because when in a uh, one way we think that. We say or we think that uh, my mind, you know, mind something we possess, you know, some uh, regard as a possession. Right. So then, when this word, there, there's a, there's, a, there's I. Which possess, you know, this mind, and I as the owner of the mind. So in this way, mind cannot be the I. So in this way, the body is not the I, and mind is not the I. So if if the, these individually body and mind individually the eye, then we should have two eyes. Two. <laughs> so the combination of body and mind. It's not the eye. So when we talk about a combination or the assemble of body and mind, uh, there are two types, the two kinds of assembles. Assemble, as, assembles? No, example. Assemble, assembles. Assemblies. Which one is the correct <coughs> combination of um, assemble, assemble, assembly of body and mind, assembly of assembly of body and mind? Um, this assembly has two types, right? Um, the continuation of assembly, the continuum assembly. And. <coughs> Uh, um, uh, simultaneous assembly. 
So what team body Chokpa say on do that need to go your bar. So it's it's the main thing is the point is that when you uh, when you say assembly or or a combination, when you talk about a combination has it must be two, you know, to combine them together. Mm -hmm. right? So the mind body, the combination of mind body, mind and body is not the I. Oh Hinduta so the, when we think about I, I is something that is not depend, which 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 is not depend upon anything else. So when we talk about a combination, that's a dependent, you know, dependent upon each other. And a combination <coughs> is a word dependent upon each other. Mm. So I is something that, you know, the thought of I rise the I <coughs> is not dependent upon anything. Mm. Is it that? that you know what we think. So then um then the body and not the I Mind is not the I. Combination of the body and mind is not the I. Then where is the I? Is is there anything else? I mean, which is the I? <coughs> then um, that is not the case either. There is no such thing, you know, called I other than these things. <coughs> If if something if I is um uh is um as something else it's um uh, is uh other than these you know body mind body mind and combination of body mind then you have to f uh we should be able to find something uh that we can point at. What you need to あ、ngā cannot be find cannot be found sorry i cannot be found oh then this can do that ah then that go bolu bi son doa kate mi ju chu yin na ni wa nam ji ji men tong se mi ju se ya tu chu mo bo tu yo na ten ta ni ru son di kar jin tong go ma li se de wa as um nagarjuna says you know glorious nagarjuna kompulu uh, protector nagarjuna says um if the mirage were were water then those who are close those who are nearby you know why shouldn't they see as a water but when you uh, when you when you <coughs> uh, mis uh, perceiving these you know mirages of water when you close you know, when you get close to that then it, it will disappear so likewise, you know, I, the I, seems like exist, you know, uh, uh, seems like um, the gain rush into a yoda rush. Okay, without investigating, without analyzing, I, the I seems. It to be there, right? I seems to be there. Or that we know the corner of the moon to was yoga in us. Then the talking chain is around you, then it's great house. Then you go. So I seems to be there if there, you know, I exist from its own side. But then if that's the case, if I exist from its own side, then you should be able to find upon investigation. Ready? Yeah. <coughs> uh, but but you are not be able to find upon investigation. 
Since uh, uh, I cannot be found upon investigation, therefore I is empty of inherent existence or existing from its own side, empty of existing from its own side. Okay. So then, if I is empty of uh, existing from its own side, then the I is but uh, um, <coughs> is the I uh, non-existent as a horns of rabbit? <laughs> that is not the case either. So we uh, we do need to say I exist conventionally. Uh, that is because of uh, because that it is attainable. You know, it is it is attainable. Um, um, uh, that I, you know, I, I, uh, I go, I sit, I eat, I drink. You know, these are tenable uh, conventionally. This exists conventionally, or this exists without an investigating. So the the, the worldly uh, beings, worldly beings, uh, do not, you know, do not investigate in this way. They just merely think that things exist, you know. Uh, so they don't uh, do not in analyze or investigate. Uh, they just merely assume things exist in you know whatever. Um, uh, they appear. Hmm. Uh, whatever way they appear. No, only Taki Chetan de Yada, Sansam Chepard Single Serva. You came about to so good you can just say it, only Rakri said. On the Yahoo and the way Yahoo Meduxia and what Tindy Taki any any Jabatin Chairman is to see your master. Can't escape. Only you can do and say it, the same Marie Seattle. The Yahoo and the Yahoo Meduxia, Jabachi as your was. But uh, but I'm not saying that the worldly beings do not analyze in or investigate at all. You know, they do analyze, they do investigate for uh, such as, you know, whether uh, it is a gold or not a gold. It is, uh, uh, well, things like that. You know, they do inv uh, investigate, analyze. So these are, these are called rangawa. Uh, Ordinary, ordinary investigations. So the, the investigation that we're talking about here is something that you are not happy with the term, the conventional existence. You are f investigating further beyond that, you know. What to do that? So that the logic, the the logic, um, uh, the awareness, you know, this awareness, this logic, this logic is called the ultimate uh, um, valid cognizer, ultimate valid cognizer. Ultimate reasoning, I'm sorry. Ultimate reasoning. So the selflessness is referring to the self which existing from its own side. Mm -hmm. So that is not exist, that is non-existent. So, which is called <coughs> selflessness. 
Ani rangon itu bati kebe tongwa insa, tu no tongwa ni selawar selawa. Tongwa kau nak siapa tu? So the the that the empty of existing from its own side. Things are empty of existing from their own side. Therefore, things are empty. Therefore, it's called emptiness. Nampak tak? Cuma nama dia dah yang lupa tertutup cakap dia orang bahasa. Kau nak ni si orang sah. La. Cuma nama dia yang lupa tertutup dia orang terhad dia orang sah. Ani tak kau nak ni si tanya tak. So, so that is the 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 true nature of all phenomena, the true mode of existence of all phenomena. So therefore, it is also called suchness. 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 Yeah. So, <coughs> in terms of um, uh, selflessness, there are two types uh, selflessness of person and selflessness of phenomena. <coughs> that is differentiated mainly uh, 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 because of the basis. Mm. So the, <coughs> the empty of um, inherent existence of person is selflessness of person, tamuik. And uh, uh, empty of inherent existence of other phenomena other than person, persons, um, aggregates such as aggregates and so forth are called the, the selflessness of, of phenomena. What is it? <coughs> So, so that um, you, you can understand okay how do you say that um, <coughs> through this you also realize or understand that there are two types of grasping at self at selves selves or self Grasping self, you know, self of person and self of phenomena. Okay, do that. Kangza, ah, rangon itu bukan zaman zaman tu. Kangza ke dalam zaman sejuta. So the um, grasping at self of ah, um, kangza rangon itu bukan zaman zaman. Um, zaman is like the grasping, which um, uh, grasping uh, at a self of person, truly existent. Inherently existent person is called the self. Um, uh, Kazak Danzi. Kazak Danzi. Uh, um, uh, grasping a self of person. Kazak is Yembi Chu. Pongola is what Ramon is to ban the mids and body. Chuji Danzans. And the grasping uh, at self of uh, phenomena other than persons. Uh, called the uh, uh, self of uh, grasping the self of phenomena. What is it? 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 So, because of that, the Dharmito Vishirab, the wisdom realizing emptiness can be two types. Right, wisdom, wisdom realizing emptiness of person, uh, persons, and wisdom realizing emptiness of uh, phenomena other than persons. So, um, in terms of um, uh, duba is obscurations. There are two types: uh, obscuration and yomumbi duba. Danzi ni the The grasping at uh, self of person and self of phenomena, together with their their seeds, are uh, obscuration to uh, to liberation. 
And all the imprints, imprints of you know grasping the self of person and so forth, all the imprints, imprints are uh, uh, obscuration to omniscient. Obscuration to uh, to knowledge, actually, it's it's obscures you to uh, to know things. To know uh, obscure, how do you say that? Um, prevents you uh, to um, uh, prevent you from uh, knowing all phenomena. As there are. Oh, like that. That. So therefore, it is obscur obscuration. It's called obscuration. To, imprints are called obscuration to omniscient. Oh, so in short, all phenomena, chenang chu, chi means ex, uh, outer, and nang means inner phenomena, are merely labeled, merely labeled by uh, mean names uh, and conceptual thoughts. There's uh, there's uh, nothing exist from it from their own side. Nothing, rang uh, uh, miss. Nothing exists from uh, from its own side, whatsoever. <laughs> uh, for instance, things are like uh, uh, those those. Um, uh, quiet spectrum, spectrum or quiet spec, spectacle or spectrum, uh, rope, <coughs> rope, uh, quiet rope. Uh, this, uh, no, no, no. Uh, tapa tau, tau means the black and white. You know, the put together, stripen, striped, striped. Speckled. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly it. speckled. Yeah, on the coiled rope. Yes, that's spell that named. Okay, that named as a snake. You know. There we go. So we think it's a snake. Yes, speckled. What in the was in sorry. So this is the rough. Explanation about emptiness. Keduta, gom ni nyam se leon du sirvata. Ane, soi, kasan ke ba nai kiri se. Ane, keta tonyu tobi ke ane langtong rangju la ke ba la ane hini du ba gom ni dogo yor sirva. Yes. So then, when you uh, when you try to practice this, when you try to meditate on emptiness, um. As a as a prerequisite, okay, in order to uh, cultivate special insight or wisdom realizing emptiness, it is necessary to uh, uh, to to cultivate a calm abiding uh, uh, first. <coughs> So um, without accomplish a calm abiding, if you try to uh, uh, cultivate 
special insight that it that would that it be um, that 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 is impossible but you will uh, gain some positive imprints more than you don't I need you that's some young here I need only top at the young you did the gong young to your bottom me but it some joe some joe share um, you will gain. You will. You you'll be able to cultivate um, uh, the wisdom of contemplation, but not wisdom uh, regarding emptiness, but not wisdom of meditation on emptiness. Gom Jong, Rebe. Gom Jong. Gom Jong is in meditation. Wisdom of meditation. Oh, ten minutes. Oh, ten minutes. Can you do that? So, <coughs> when you meditate, then uh, the six <coughs> preliminaries, six preliminaries must be preceded, must be um, uh, preceded, must proceed. Okay. And then the one of the most important uh, thing is that one need to uh, purify negativities, accumulate merit and purify negativities through seven limb practice. So then the uh, we did explain how to uh, practice the seven prayers practices um, uh, earlier. So then you make uh, <coughs> mandala offerings, mandala offerings, and then make this prayer of supplications, pray, stone prayer of supplications, supplications, um, uh, you know, uh, to be able to cultivate or generate the, uh, um, uh, the correct view of emptiness in one's continuum. And then from that point, one uh, uh, needs to uh, dissolve the merit field. And uh, uh, one needs to uh, dissolve the merit field. So there are there are few <coughs> few uh, traditions. So in any case, you know, then one should dissolve the merry field to oneself. Okay. <coughs> So then um, one should uh, meditate on emptiness. So initially uh, one should uh, investigate or analyze that the I who is going to meditate emptiness, you know, we should uh, analyze that I who is eventually going to meditate on emptiness. <coughs> so that is done by um, four, uh, four reasonings, four 
enhance enhance uh, four so the thought of I, you know, how that I arise to that this thought, when you think about I, how that I arise to the to that thought. You do that. It's important to have. Ah, <coughs> uh, So how that I arise in one's mind, you know, <coughs> should. Uh, mm, uh, how that I arise in one's mind it's important to um, to to recognize or to uh-huh. when, you, when you say arise do you mean how is it experienced or experienced yeah, pro- probably, probably. Um, but arise? the word that the the literal um, um, uh, uh, shar means appear or arise appear to your mind <coughs> okay i see okay <coughs> appear sharma is appear okay did i have to drama da yung guru was so that many uh, uh the different t- ways to appear this eye to your mind i don't think that nga si adan zamre you could think to your dev and was the same could think the in this order was good so this sometimes the eye seems appear from your body look into your deva sometimes it appears to you as if if it is exists on your body sometimes that eye you know appears to you as if it is exists on your mind that the so that is not the um, the correct ones you know a, a way of appearing to your mind the eye appearing to your mind the that, uh, that is not the way that innate, innate grasping <coughs> Uh, holds your eye or perceives your eye. Nick, you want to see some matter about that. Counter. Get to that counter on it. Dagger to you don't send me the wasta. Mass, I didn't tell you that's the get to tell a ten dagger your was. So, as a basis of imputation, the eye, you know, basis of imputation is uh, are the body and mind, right? Alternate that you send me. So if that I I is appearing to you as if it is not depending upon neither on the body nor on the mind then that is the correct way of appearing uh, to you. you so ex- actually I, if I is you know appearing to you as if it is exists on the combination of body and mind oh that would be the correct one so that if that eye is appearing to you on, on a combination of body and mind, it's kind of the same, uh, how do you call that? Uh, there is no... Uh, uh, um, um, so when that thought of I, uh, I arise or appear, that when I appear to you, appears to you, 
uh, that appears as if it is exist from its own side. That is definite. You know that is for sure. For sure. That I will appears to you as if it's it is you know exist from its own side. It's always like that. To, us, to ordinary sentient beings, okay, because uh, whatever things appear to us, um, uh, they appear to us as the you know they exist from their own side. So, if that I uh, exist on Dashi Pongbo on the basis of aggregates, it must be exist one with the aggregates. Or different from the aggregates. So there's no third possibilities. It has to be. 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 It has And then also we need to gain a certainty. Gain a certainty. If the eye is neither on the body, uh, one with the body, nor different from the body, then that eye should be you should gain a certainty of not I is not not existing upon this that is because of uh, of if um, of um, um, in general okay in general um, if Whatever phenomena is, you know, what if whatever phenomena, if is, uh, has to be either one or uh, different, exist one or exist as one or different. Does it make sense? One with or different from. Yes. <coughs> so um, there's. Um, Nothing other than these two. Oh, better now, Yinker, but ah, say, I tell you, now, now, you, you're not in Yana, the Pongo, the Chig, the Yogori, Yana, Pongo, the Taddy, the Yogori, the Pongo, the Chig, the Taddy, count the men at the Megori, some at the Takyo Gurus. So, 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 therefore, if I exist, you know, uh, uh, Said the Yuna said again, then what were you? So, exist has to be one with aggregate, or either one with aggregates or different from the aggregates. And if it's not <coughs> neither one of these, you know, if it's ne uh, I exist uh, neither one with the body nor different from the body, then I should be non existent. So that is the Niniba. Um, There's a second point, uh, um, uh, certaining, a certain, <coughs> gaining a certainty of privation. Something like that. Privation. What do you do? What do you do? What do and then third point is that uh, uh, we should think about that, okay, uh, should contemplate that I exist one with the body. If I exist one with the body, then there's, uh, it will be harmed by many uh, uh, other reasonings. <coughs> by reasoning so if I is one with the uh, aggregates then um, um, it, 
you know, there there is there are five aggregates, you know, then there must be five eyes. Or the eye is singular, you know, eye is one, so there, uh, there uh, shouldn't be five aggregates. Something but then the, uh, the, there are one eye and five aggregates. Right? So there cannot be one. So if you are um, um, confused, confused with five aggregates, then you can just take the body in mind, you know, whether I is one with the body in mind or different from this. So if I is one with the body in mind, then I should be I should become two. Does it make sense? Yana, there must be two eyes. So or since there is one eye, then the the body and mind should become one with that eye. So, so then that cannot be because uh, there are eyes one singular and body and mind is two. So, um, so then one should be certain with uh, that I is not one with the body and mind. So one should gain a certainty with regarding this I is not one with the body and mind. But there are many reasonings, but it will confuse you more. <laughs> so that's the third point is called the uh, uh, certainty with regarding uh, uh, free from uh, uh, one or something like that. So there's a name, but I'm not really sure with that. Keep trying. Keep trying. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> regarding? Uh, regarding Dembichik, uh, Demba means true, truly existent one. Something like that. <coughs> truly existent one. Dembichik, 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 and then the fourth point is, uh, is uh, contemplating about uh, investigating whether that I is different from the aggregates, different from the aggregates. <coughs> if I is in <coughs> body and mind, then uh, after taking away, you know, body and mind, I should be, should be, I should be uh, left, you know, I should be there, something like Maybe. that. But after uh, separating body and mind, or the, uh, I don't know how to say that, um, is like uh, after taking away the body and mind, there's, you cannot find <coughs> I, you know, something other than body and mind. <coughs> Also, you you know, after taking away these five aggregates, you cannot find I other than the five aggregates. Oh, today do that, ma. See, I did. I didn't put more than chicken on me. 
So therefore, the I is um, uh, not one with aggregates, uh, body and mind, or no different from the body and mind. Then it's important to generate this certainty of that I that uh, is non-existent. I know the, uh, the inherent existent I is, is non-existent. <laughs> <laughs> so if you uh, think that I is completely non-existent, then you are in a, you've, you've, uh, you're in a uh, side of the, the annihilation, the, the extremes <coughs> of in annihilation, uh, nihilism. Mm. <laughs> So, so from this point, it's important to have a certainty, uh, a certainment, a certainment, uh, uh, a certainment of that I is not existing from its own side. Okay. And in terms of uh, is ngengor, uh, okay, nangor um, uh, ngengor. In terms of one should, you know, things should appear from this point. Things should appear, tongsang uh, number, as uh, empty of inherent existence or empty from their own side. What did you get that? by ni dang dem bas go yo yin bae so this uh, certainty and appearance of emptiness must be there che chu ni den che chu ni den the two characteristics or two two uh che chu um two um che chu ni den so one must have these two uh um certainty and appearance the two um kichu is normally translated as a, as as a characteristics you know. so do you understand there's two uh, characteristics so then you just uh continue you know uh meditate on this you know remain on this mm. these two characteristics okay. so with you remain this state uh with the with the you know, with the factor of you know stability stability mental stability if you uh, your your mind lose become weak, you know, kind of, then you should go back and uh, analyze those four points again. Like so if your mind can remain on this meditation on this two points, characteristics, then you should just let it be, you know. So in terms of your session, meditation session, should not be too long, you know, uh, not more than half an hour. It's about half an hour. It depends, you know, your uh, ability, your 
your mind, Lord Timba means your mind. Only my kid letter. Yet on her water. Anne Benatoran, Anne Nado, Chidochi, Anne Gondak, Tun Ye Gomna. So you sh uh, if you're doing meditations, you should do uh, four sessions a day at least, early morning and dawn, um, <coughs> and uh, uh, um, uh, late uh, late morning, and then afternoon and <coughs> evening. I tell you, what I turn to I you can uh, have more sessions, like six sessions, or eight sessions per day, or even uh, um, eighteen sessions per day. Hmm. <laughs> 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 so at least. You know, two times a day, like <laughs> once morning, one in the evening. No, I didn't know what to do. 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 I didn't know what So from that session, when you arise from, you know, from that session, when the session ends, you know, during the post sessions, you try to view everything as an illusion. Oh, everything is an illusion. Try to oh, see everything as an illusion. But you will be um, uh, will be challenging, you know, because things will rise, you know, things some things can help you and some things harm you, <coughs> right? So or ranking when you do about do something on me, you be going to water. I So then these things although appear as some things helpful help helpful and some things, you know, harmful. But it's but in reality they are like an illusion, you know. So this illusion, illusory yoga must be practiced during your post sessions. I want to need the way inside. I want to need you that so your um during the sessions and during, you know as well as post sessions um this your the strength of your practices must be uh eco you understand that eco 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 <laughs> eco <laughs> sorry <laughs> so this meditation is in order to uh, generate uh, the higher training of wisdom. So for that you need the higher training of concentration as the basis of your practice. It's the basis for both, uh, common basis for co uh, higher training of concentration and wisdom will be the higher training of morality. So, uh, practicing these three higher training, higher trainings, with conjoined with the renunciation of cyclic existence, is the unmistaken path to 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 liberation. So that practice will lead you will. Be uh, be able to attain uh, a liberation or nirvana. Yeah, do that. 
Yamne ji masun pa yena ane tarwa to ya de ni to da ane rang jar ke tarwa ji thing me ji tarwa to ko yin bali so these practices you know uh just merely this practice uh, without um uh, without uh conjoined with bodhicitta uh chanju sem da uh and and uh, and the the, the bodhisattva's conduct six perfection six perfections uh, then the your liberation will be either hearers or solitary realizers that he didn't do me can you be same thing on it I I need to keep all us what the duck Simba you know that you need some materials yes it's your bad boy or was so if these practices are conjoined with the bodhicitta and compassion, great compassion, um, then your practices are called the, the bodhisattva's conduct. Okay. As a result for that is the, the great result or, or the Buddhahood. Then from this point, if you uh, enter in the, into the practices of 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 tantra, tantrayana practice, um, you will achieve Buddhahood as you practice in you know, a sutrayana the same buddhahood but in terms of uh, time in term, uh, as you will attain through the tantrayana practice you will attain uh, liberation of buddhahood uh, fast oh, how, do do <laughs> how do you say that oh, cooker yeah cooker yes <laughs> um <laughs> Uh, in terms of Tantra Yana, Tantra, there are four types uh Yudishi, uh, four types of Tantra. So the highest uh 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 the um the the highest yoga tantra. Uh, let's see. Highest yoga tantra. So entering into the uh, practice of the highest yoga tantra, that will uh, uh, um, enables you to attain uh, Buddhahood. Um, in okay, in this very lifetime, the t the lifetime of of this uh, degeneration, degenerating degenerating sentient beings lifetime. I want to know that. Now let me see. I think I'm like you. Why you not be any? I'm new. She. Now I need to be careful. Now what you need to do is that you. So the the highest yoga tantra is more. Subject is uh, is has uh, the special um, specialties specialties of being uh, fast or being profound. Ready, da? Tambo ni ke ani ngal la misa tambo ni se ni ke thala ngam ni ke ani juya insa majestero. But it's not the case you know it's very from the very beginning you know you think that's the the quickest path the mm -hmm. you know means to attain buddhahood and you just kind of you know run towards that without having any basis for instance you're building this you know nine story building you know so you I wanted to build the the ninth floor first. It's impossible, right? You have to build up from the first to the ninth, 
Al man git ya bu su görüyor yer var. So you need a, you need a good <coughs> foundation. O tele yedi ta. Ha tege lam tamam bi ene jöle pat yang son yin bari. So that's good foundation is uh is um gu chang is purify one's continuum with the common paths. Jö yang se az chama te ma da. あれ、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、で、
So what can I say? I do my duty. So external or internal is mainly differentiated by uh, whether that's a uh, uh, do, whether it's uh, in, in, enclosed by enclosed or enclosed by uh, continuums or not. You understand that? Yeah, continuum. Yeah. Okay. Anything else? Uh huh. Uh huh. Two questions. Here one. Okay. <clears throat> when you were, um, I think on the either the first or second point, when you were doing the four points, um, <clears throat> I think you Geshe had said something about the correct way of viewing, you know, the object of negation, the I. And I put it down as a basis of imputation, the I is body and mind. If it appears to you as it exists on the body and mind, that's the correct way. But I'm not sure about my wording here. What is, can he clarify a little bit about what is the correct way of viewing this, I guess, when you're investigating in terms of he said something about on body and mind. Mm -hmm. Second did, did point. Uh, I think it was just first point. Yeah, I, I guess I'm just unclear. Can the next thing that we can get away with? Gajang even is the first first one is identifying the object of negation, right? The other thing that Carson did so many things is Lucem getting to Carsi. I'm not the Lucem getting to. Lusim getting to Tanjichi Gashang even net the Tata Maris and a Lusim needing to capture Jumeva and a Angadi Korangu Troop Devaroch Tommy, not Tati and a Tata Chagor, Casa Danzin Casa, Denzin Hengig, Zimba Targ, not Teres, so so. What did the Dodger in you? Tishiraya on Gotsu Masons. Timan Gotsu Smart, Kaja Tagaran Gotsu Smart. Or it is the Tandi Gagasia, I think, Ramoni to Batta Kako. So here the uh, object of negation is uh, the I which is existing from its own side, right? Uh, so that has to be refuted. Right. So here, the f during the f first point, you try to identify how that I appears to your mind, right? So I do exist in general, right? I do exist. I, uh, I, I, I exist, in, uh, exist conventionally. And then as a basis of um, uh, the imputation of I is the aggregates, right? Other aggregates. The basis of imputation of I. So, so when uh, uh, I appears to your mind uh, by, in, by depending upon aggregates, right? The aggregates. So we do have this kind of uh, uh, sense of uh, 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 is like uh, we do have this you know this thought or this um, thought I exist thought that I exist upon in, in, uh, aggregates. Somewhere there, you know, somewhere on aggregates. So here, that in the you know we should uh, uh, investigate or think about how that I appears to that thought of I, right? So, so here, you know, some uh, some um, scholars, you know, some lamas say that you should differentiate between 
the mere I and I which is existing from its own side. Otherwise, you will fall into the ex uh, you know extremes of annihilation. So, so then the other Lama says, no, it's not necessary to differentiate. Okay. So when you be able to differentiate, when you be able to differentiate between I, the mere I, and I, which is truly existing from its own side. So that that time, you already have realized emptiness. Until you have realized emptiness, you cannot differentiate between mere I and I, which is existing from its own side. <coughs> so when we, you know, this thought of I arise, or um, thought of I arise, then that the mm -hmm. the I appears to that thought. Okay. So whatever appears to that thought uh, appears as if existing from its own side. So, so that appearance, it's important to identify that appearance. And then the So that I actually arise from that basis of imputation, aggregates. Right. So that appears from that basis is like it's a in uh, in an eco kind of eco sense. So here the uh, the basis of imputation is the combination of body and mind. Combination of body and mind. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, that that answers my question. I I think in practice it's it's hard to remain and get a clear picture on that because mm -hmm. it quickly quickly you know you think oh I, think I can't find it and then I sort of <laughs> drift off. But I know I have. <laughs> you know, it's like I've I've heard it said that you have to just keep bringing yourself back to that and try and get a clearer and clearer picture of it. But. Mm -hmm. That's difficult for me. Of course, it is difficult. Uh, <laughs> it's a difficult, but it's important to uh, you know to uh, contemplate or uh, analyze that how uh, uh, how that I appears to you, how that I is, or something like that. So we need to think about it. You know, we should uh, investigate on that. It's not just saying like a temporary you know, investigation, but it's in a short period of time. Okay. And should, you know, continue. This is something that you should done uh, in, a, in your daily life, in your daily, and in, you know, sessions and post sessions. You should think about this all the time. So. Mm hmm. So I'm still not clear on um, mind and body are dependent on one another or are not dependent on one another. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, they're in course. Yes, they're dependent upon each other. 
even though there are two. But they're um the near was again. Lucem ni said near was not content embarrass. What today is content embarrass to the Nija. When you talk about you know dependently arising or dependent, uh, there must be two things, you know, dependent upon each other or dependent upon one on the other. Our gross mind, you know, gross mind or consciousness are very much rely on our body, physical body. When you, uh, when you, you know, when you grow up, you know, when you uh, reach a certain age, dharma is like, um, the, uh, uh, how do you call that? The, um, uh, dharma, dharma, how do you say that? Um, dharma said the kind of thing again, lotus. So between you know between uh okay between eighteen to um to to um six you know fifty five um, sixty sixty years you know, um but this is not you know this is in general you know in general your uh since your body is kind of uh uh fully uh, ripened, p fully uh, developed. developed, yeah, p fully developed. Your mind also sharp, you know, clear. Supposed to. So, um, so th as, as a little, you know, child, they are not completely developed yet, you know. So their mind is not that sharp, and uh, also those who are rich, you know, like eighty-five, uh, eighty and ninety years old, they already lose their, you know, physical strength. So their mind also, the gross consciousness also kind of. Um, um, uh, uh, loosening up. You know. um, so, so that makes it's it's just, it is clear, you know, that gross consciousness uh, uh depend, you know, heavily depend on our body. Especially, you know, especially our eye, you know, vision, you know, vision is also uh, the the eye consciousness also depends upon you know body heavily the the the, the eye sense power you know Madre. don't you think so yes. oh that does seem huge to travel yourself but there, there is a subtle subtle consciousness very subtle consciousness or the thing is that you will really thank you so much so that is not actually uh depend uh, upon this, the, the physical body for this life. You know, so. so that uh, that subtle, very subtle consciousness goes uh, on. You know, when you when uh, for the, to the next lives. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> 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 <laughs>